Ariel Hawani at the Strike Force event in Hoffman Estates, Illinois, alongside Lisa Marie Varon, aka Victoria, aka Tara, professional wrestler extraordinaire. It is it's great to meet AKAs, you. Yes, right? Exactly. exactly. And not the American that. Kickboxing Academy, just aka, no, also yeah, known also as. Also known as, yes. The are you? The number one um, pro wrestler. That you're biggest fan, right? Right. Wait, uh, I'm your biggest fan or yeah. you're my biggest fan? It, but both, you know, I am your biggest fan. Right. You know that. How are you? I'm excited to be here. You have no idea. It's Got interesting that you are here because uh, I remember less than two years or so ago, you were telling me that you wanted to be an MMA fighter. Big time. Are you here to scope out the competition or are you here just as a fan? Gosh, unfortunately, I am not scoping out the competition. I am a major fan of Tate and Kunin, so I am here to support the women. And at the same time, it's in Chicago. I just moved here, opening a restaurant locally. So um, I, I don't know if you're aware that I injured myself mm -hmm. um, in a steel cage match in, against Mickey James on TNA Impact Wrestling and um, eventually need to get that Tommy John surgery. So. MMA is probably out for me, so unfortunately. That's it? It's done? <sighs> Gosh. The I'm, dream I'm, is over? I'm so bummed. I'm still doing jujitsu on the side, you know, so we'll see about how that turns out. But it, realistically, you know, I'm 40. If I would have started this maybe when I turned 30, I think I could be ahead of the game mm -hmm. and be in the mix. But realistically, I have to kind of really say, you know, it's either pro wrestling, own, you know, run a restaurant. I'm, I, you know, I finally, I had to face the facts, right. honestly. What happened between now and maybe two years ago? Because two years ago, you were ready to go. You know, you were talking about Kim Couture, all this stuff. And then it, it didn't seem as though you, you could get the ball rolling, essentially. You know, Bobby Lashley, you know, Brock Lesnar says, you know, it's really hard to do pro wrestling at the same time as training for an MMA fight. I mean, it's, we're on the road, you know, and it's constantly takes its toll on us. Um, you, you think, you know, we're, it's entertainment, but at the same time, we do need to heal our bodies and it, it sucks. I'll, I'll be honest with you. I wish I can do both, but it's, it's almost impossible. And Kim Couture, I've been watching, you know, and it's, it's really, I, I consider myself good friends with her now, you mm -hmm. know, after that fiasco in TNA. You're actually friends. Yeah, actually, yes. I, te I text her and asked her if she was going to be coming to this and invited her out to dinner, just, you know, but she's not here. But I've been watching her, and as a friend, I'm really concerned about her. I'm so afraid what's going to happen to her out there in the ring. Um, first of all, when she broke her jaw, she still continued to fight. Um, it, the, or the orbit, mm -hmm. the orbital, uh, that is frightening. And then the last submission I saw, it was really disturbing. Um, even if I didn't know her, it was disturbing. But now that I know her, I, I'm, I'm afraid for her. And I would like to see her. She's a great athlete, great heart, and a warrior. I would like her to, to see her go into pro wrestling. So you want to see her step away I, from MMA you know, and come to pro wrestling? Yeah, because, you know, you can still be an athlete and show your skills. You know, on another level, it's entertainment. Um, but, man, I would take her under the, my wing and teach her what I've got and um, hopefully see her in WWE or in Impact Wrestling someday. Have you told her this? I have not. And um, I plan gonna on... going to find out. <laughs> she will find out. I love you, Kim. This is from the bottom of my heart. I'm concerned about you, and I'm just looking out as a friend, you know? I'm wondering, if we were talking maybe 15 or so years ago, would you have chosen to go into MMA over, over pro wrestling if MMA was as popular uh, back then? I, I would have chosen to go to MMA. Um, you, you know me. I'm very competitive, and when I what I put myself into I'm 100% and you know how I got into wrestling was an accident I was at the right place at the right time I had a good look for wrestling and met China said I had good look for it that's how this happened and when I saw the MMA I'm so intrigued by it um, you know my brothers were amateur wrestlers my oldest brother Bobby Soul went to you know the Pan Am Olympics um, and it was always in their art family, very competition, just education as well. Is We're very competitive on that, too. So I, I'm addicted to this now. This is it's a drug, honestly. I love everything about this sport. All right, well, I'm sorry to hear that uh, you're not going to actually compete. I know. I'm I was so hoping sad. that we could break some news here, but you're, we're breaking well, a different kind of news. Different kind of right. news. You know, so hopefully Kim Couture can come to, our, to my side. But um, I'm here. I'm hoping, you know, the girls you know, get the credit they deserve in every sport, you know, as females don't, you know, succeed as much as the men. And um, I'm here to support the women and um, looking for a good fight tonight, All you right. know. It sounds yeah. like a lot of the wrestlers are interested in this fight. You were telling me that uh, off camera, right? Absolutely. We're all pretty much addicted. Um, it's 
t to MMA. Mm -hmm. And uh, a lot of people want to make fun of pro wrestling as entertainment, but we know what it is. You know, it's it's hard on our body as well, but we are, this is a new, this is so new to me still. And I feel like a little kid watching a new sport, you know? I'm, I'm really loving this sport. MMA is awesome and I'll be a fan forever. Great to hear. Enjoy your first Strike Force event and great to see you uh, in person. Thanks. You want to hug me or something? I, do, I don't know what I to do, do here. Wow. I do. I never I thought I'd be able to hug uh, oh, Victoria. Yeah, you can, you can, um, I have my new rel my website. You can I'll yeah, probably here's the form right here. putting your little link on. on oh, this. Too. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. RealLisaMarie.com. And I love you guys and thanks for being so supportive. And sorry you won't see me in the MMA octagon ring, but you'll see me kick butt somewhere else. Deal. Wow. Well, good day for me. <laughs>